Into the dark, episode one. Stop, please stop. Can I taser her? No, let me taser her. No, stop, stop. Oh, thank God for that. I'm moving you down. No, please don't. How many times, Davina? How many times do I have to tell you? I hate giving chase. Bloody hell, look at the state of me. I'm knackered. I'm sweat dripping. Going to be uncomfortable for the whole bloody day now. Please, look, I'm asking you, right woman to woman, yeah. Just one more time, please. Please, you know, Davina, the drug dealing. I can handle the lies. God, even using your own children to deliver the gear. Is it just what it comes to expect? You know, the thing that pisses me off is that despite all these ill world gains, you're still claiming benefits, which means mugs like me pay for the privilege of chasing you around the bleeding streets. Oh, leave her, leave her, leave her, leave her. Just come back now. Back. Oh, no, get in the car. Get the car now. Oh, shit, God, is this as fast as you can go? Oh, God, it's only a punch. Why is it? I'm pregnant, okay? You? You didn't tell no one, Mickey. I didn't even, I haven't even told Paul yet. It's okay, it's all right. Heartbeat, he's fine. Oh, she, or she. Let me check about around a bit. I think everything looks perfectly normal. Helen, I don't know who else to call. Is everything okay? Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. But I reckon my days on the street are over for a while. Yeah, please and Postford. I'm continuing to search. Oh, God, have you seen this? The schoolgirls, Poppy Johnson, Abigail Toms. Abigail went missing three weeks ago, and Poppy was saying, last seen getting in the car yesterday. Don't you guess it's here for the rest of this evening? So weird to see Pulsford. All over the news, it's awful. I spoke, I spoke to Dad. He said the place is calling the press. Yeah, police have mounted intensive research for open ground in this area. Although their efforts are being hampered by extensive flooding, been raining intensely here for over for three weeks. Tonight, the two girls still missing. The tension here is palpable. This is a community shock, Paul. In the bathroom, I need to talk to you. Well, I'll, I won't, won't, won't be sick. I'm pregnant. Are you serious? Oh, Helen. Hey, have you washed your hands? No. Can I have another kiss? Please, such can into the search. So I know we're not in, out of the woods yet. I can, but I can't tell my mum. She'll be like, well... It made a, a year, make a year, it make a decade. But it has been seen getting the car yesterday. God, it's what we've got to look forward to. Twenty years of fear. Come on now. How rare is this stuff? Is are little children killers? There's always a bit of someone known to them. Mm, better keep an eye out on you, Ian, then. Shall I open this? Ah, uh, why, really? One glass. Everybody knows that's okay. Ian, one more... Even more difficult because of torrential rain, central flooding in the area. Oh my god, what have I done? Oh, a copper, I didn't see any myself sitting in cash with my tits out all day. Helen, it would be great. Look, I take some time off. I'll just hang out. The three of us, come on. I mean, can't say things have been easy lately. Yeah, we've hardly seen each other. That's why coppers get together, isn't it? So you don't have to. Any more news of the man they brought to questioning? Sources close to the quarry have told us that the man is Stephen Bates, a resident of Pulsford. 37-year-old Bates, shit. What, the suspect's wife? I know her. Jane Lander Jackson. That's what she used to be called. She was my best friend. Man currently custody, having stated the investigation, taking a stride forward as Helen. He had an investigative team in place. What do you want to, don't want you budging in there? But I'm not, I've got special knowledge of the area. Suspect's wife is a childish friend. I'm sorry, you can't allow it. Okay. Well, uh, there's another issue. I'm pregnant. I haven't look, been feeling very well recently. So I'd like to request a week's leave starting today. Well, congratulations. I'm going to have to go to Pulsford. As obviously, tell my father the good news. Right, and tell him to do access to the inmates, but no stuffing on anyone's toes. Understand, Helen? Yeah, I understand. What are you doing? I'm coming for you. No, Ellen, you're pregnant. You've got hormones raging around your body. Oh, which makes that a very brave sentence. Seriously, Paul, I don't even know, need you here, there. The whole time I know you've been, it's you, it's been. Hate the place. Reminds me of my mum dying. Then all of a sudden I won't go back. Yeah, well, she's my best friend. When's the last time you saw her? The other hadn't heard you mention her. I need to help her. 
vine. You see, this is a mini break. What? My, that's my dad doing the man hunt. You've got a fun day of a holiday. You okay? Shall we go straight to your dad's? No, let's see where they move Linda to first. They're at the Weeks and Hopkins. I've got authorization. I've had the Weeks, an old friend of Linda Jackson. I mean Bates, Dr. D.C. Sophie Carlson. This is Dr. Hopkins. Does you look fine? I'll go for a walk, take in the sights. I'll let you know you're, you're here. Then do you got a visitor? Helen Weeks. Oh, hello. You didn't take you girls, them girls, you know. They went, they got it wrong, didn't they? So I think they may, sometimes they make mistakes. They start returning Christmas cards. Sorry, my career sort of becoming all consuming. At a school union last year. Yeah, well. Yeah, it was a laugh. What was it? What were all the faces? All right. Hi, that's Charlie. How's your sister? Oh, she's fine. She's married and she's got a couple of kids. I found out I'm pregnant. I left it late. Yeah, yeah, I suppose I did. You love it? Well, we all don't know. How about you? You, Stephen, how long have you been married? Five years. You're not around here from here to here. Danny, Charlie, aren't his. Danny, uh, Brown, my youngest. He's upstairs. He refuses to come down. Oh, yeah, Stephen's great of him. Um, like did his own, seeing as, as it's bloody obvious what you're thinking. Anyone else, everybody else is. Paul Watkins, the one and only. Last time since, long time since Hendon. Yeah, good to see you, man. And you? I didn't realize you ended up around these parts. Yeah, it's temporary. Oh, still big fish in small pond, huh? In Manchester. Yeah, yeah, for my sins. Oh, cool, good. Uh, what can I do for you? Nearly nothing, really. My girlfriend's down, a bit down visiting my father. Thought he'd come and see how... So- the search is going. Your girlfriend being had in weeks. I want to give her a nod to talk to Linda. Oh, truth is, it's been a bloody nightmare. Bloody means we don't can't search as thoroughly. A lot of places. River's moving so fast. Too hard for the drive at divers. The way you, that's where they think they are. The river been the most been the most obvious thing. Flying so fast, they're gonna they're like, gonna like. Hmm. When does it get comes to getting rid of the bodies? This weather's pretty awful. Bodies? It must could be still alive. Two girls, one missing over three weeks. We think, hmm? So well, what was Bates saying? And he picked up Poppy when she was on his way to the night out in Tilsford. So I mean, he's not denying picking her up. He didn't, he can't, because we got witness. She's denying killing her. Or well, the first girl. In case he never picked her up. We're checking his car now. Maybe we'll find something. Wait, listen. You can, you can get me a stand of hair right now. Go straight in charge that smug prick. Smug? Yeah, he's got one of those faces. Right, well, listen. I'll get in, I'll get in your, out of your way. Right, mate, take care. Make the most of your time, man. Go to the village, what a village. It's not under a foot of water. And go and add a load of, a load of a very little policeman. Be realistic. See you, mate. Yeah. Hope, see you later. Hey, hey, come in. You're soaking. Hey, Robert. What the hell are we doing? Good to see you. Hey, Biddy. What's your name? Oh, lovely. Sid, this is full. Let me make briefly the golfing thing, thing. Hey, mate. Good to see you again. And you and you welcome. Hi, Sid. Long time. I thought we'd be, you'd be earlier. No, I had to go and see Linda. This is what it takes to go to, to get her, go home, ho home, you know, the crime scene. It's terrible, isn't it? She's the best friend she's told you, yeah? Yeah, she did. I did I'm not saying she's he's guilty, but uh you want to start a parcel, clean out my hand. A post office, never apologize. Oh well, send him down. No, actually there. Well there's another reason when we got to the, some news for you. Oh god, you're not yeah. We're going to be grandparent dads. Come here, congratulations, you Well done, mate. Thanks, brother. Hey, come on, come through. Tea for four. Yeah, come on, good boy. Oh well, on a sweet furniture, been seen better days. Do they call that a king size? I have a bit of bad mouth. Them on trip divisor. Are you okay? Yeah, just got weird. It's just weird being back. You know, you know, seeing Linda, this room. You know, you tell people that you're pregnant. They're like, oh wow, fantastic. Oh my god, it's gonna be amazing. What if I'm not? I can't see myself in industrial jeans. Why well, my asses? What? Wait here. Imagine we're the one. We have one that looks like her. Oh, now how she's cute. I don't I wouldn't mind that face looking up at you. I'm going to remind you of that when she needs fading at four o'clock in the morning. You were, you were a cute kid. 
I'm excited for him. There's a new start for us. I love you. I love you. Hey, turn on TV on. What, please? Won't yet confirm as a body? Is that even a missing schoolgirl, Poppy Johnson, or Abigail Toms? What do you say? Is that the body believed to be that a young fe- white female discovered nearby woodland? Think of them poor parents. It's awful. Formal investigation not been completed. My puppy is last seen at the 6th of April. Hello, Helen, it's me. They're taking me in for questioning. Will you come in with me, please? Yeah, of course I will. There's, there as soon as I can. It's Linda. They're taking her in for questioning. I've got to go. It's covered the body of a gruesome development in case. He said, so shocked, Linda, so you're probably aware a body was d- discovered early this morning, Woodlands, and the rest of the town, which is a I- bit or poppy. Well, there's no form of investigation as yet, but in the same it's a body of your Tom's. Do you know her? I knew who she was, um, but I didn't know her. Well, that's Steve. Same. She never had been, seen, been in a car. Not that I know of. Right. Well, that's what he told us. Your husband? I have a girl who never been in his car, afraid to say he wasn't telling the truth. Friends, it test proved out beyond. I doubt that she was. Has, well, been made some kind of mistake. Your husband smokes marbles, lights, doesn't he? Yeah, so he found a cigarette at the end of the body. Caught in plastic. What plastic? Our girl's body is wrapped in plastic and bin bags. So, it was Hannibal Light. DNA results are in uh, here are in today, so by this afternoon, your husband's DNA will be all over it. No, that's not possible. You don't have to do this. But what? Do what? Say that you, what you think you, you, you should protect him? I'm not, Helen. Can you say something? Look, I'm running in the reservation, not her. Please direct all your answers to me, okay? All you, may, all you they mean is that you can't think of anything that might help. Right now, the time, the time is to speak up. Do you know what we that we took your husband's computer from your house? Yes, we found some stuff. Hard drive. It's deemed to be quite significant. Like what? Porn. Let's say it's age specific. Huh? All right. So he's looking at porn. Don't you, detective? That doesn't. This doesn't. This is a, this is fancy, right? Who hasn't watched porn? Who I know. Uh, I know I have. Well, what does it make the, me a murderer? Does it? Detective Poppy Johnson. Night she went missing. Steve was watching porn. He says he was in a pub in Elmerstone. The curious records show he's at home watching some of this stuff here. Can you explain that? Well, it happens, Linda. You still have Danny and Charlie. You need to think about their lives together. Your life without Stephen. Go back. Go on, get back. Get see the bastards there, twenty thirty journalists, or one piece of us. This is how innocent people get treated. Can you see the photo they're using of him? They're painting him like a murderer. Been in a trying day. Do you think you should have a rest? You know, I'll run a bar for something. I may you offer me tea. I'll take your bed off. There's no use in there. Letting uh, say him say whatever he wanted. Is it my case? I told you, Linda. I'm here as a friend. I think I'm kidding myself about Steve. Don't you? You're knowing that what's staring in the face. I've no idea. Yeah. Well, I know because I know him. He lived with me, him. I never held him. I've had him inside me. He's not a man who hurts young girls. I want to help you. Hey. All right. Could you not, could they not put, have put you, us in a hotel? This place thinks of dogs, man. Oh, yeah. You and your sister want anything? I could get you some food. Mm. Chips and ice. Chips and rice. Tomorrow sauce. Right, coming up. Here is she. She's doing cartwheels. Yeah, well. What she does feel like shit. she tell you anything? Yeah, she did, actually. She knows where the other girl's body is. They were on it together. In it together. Some weird sexual thing, you know. Have they killed them? They shaved each other's brains out. Fucking hell, look professional. Speaking, speaking, this is none of your business. Well, I'm cool. Might have been thrown out of here. Fine. But you remember this. Whatever that, that, that she married was done, it, there might be nothing. If you've done nothing wrong. You sure about that? Yeah, because you're all school friends. Not because I've got, I've got my job. Oh, God, bloody TVs in clubs. I'm oh, sorry, excuse me. Have you got a table for two? Tell ten minutes. You want to wait? 
You can have to get a drink at a bar. You're here fine. What about we're heading back home? I mean, there's nothing else we c- can do here. <coughs> no, no, not yet. I mean, you can go back if you want, but I want to stay for Helen having the weeks. It's me. Oh, my God. Don't tell me you remember me. Don't you remember? Of course I do. Polar days, your pennies, mate. I know, I know. Oh, fancy seeing you here. Days and weeks back together. I looked for you a few times on Facebook. Oh, you should not. You're not on it? No. Oh, you should. It's a laugh. Your Jenny's looking well under all that kindness. Is this your fella? Oh, the, yes. Sorry, this is Paul. Pleased to meet you. Oh, copper, is he? Well, it's a face, apparently. The place is warming with them. Well, yeah, we both are, actually. No way, you filth. No offence. What do you do? What do you do? What? No, what do you do? You do. What do you do? I'm a nurse. Well, a good, wait, load of good, 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 good as we are. Hey, Gav, do you want a bloody table? This is Helen, a room mate from school. Oh, hi, yeah. This is a uh, fellow Paul. You right, mate? This is Gavin, local sex guard. At your service. How has it been? Bloody mental. I ain't stopped since lunch. He's with Cabby. All oh, right. It's crazy, mate, I'm telling you. It's like a circus in town. Mind you, I'm not complaining. It helps me pay for my sweetheart. Oh, it's not me. He means it's four by four. I mean, swear to God, he said the thing. If it wasn't legal, legal. Oh, well, I'm not sure it is illegal. I may be right. Maybe in public, coppers. Better check my road text. It's up to date then. Private, painted lager in the street by in black. Then, when are you ready, mate? Okay, when, what can I get you? A uh, half a lager, pint of Guinness. Thanks, pint of Guinness and half a lager. Well, please, mate. So, you, um, you were here for the murders. Keep your voice down. We don't know Stephen Bates didn't... You know Stephen Bates, don't you? Do you think he did it? Not a clue. I mean, either way, I wouldn't surprise me. You know, who, who knows what goes on here? I mean, no one really knows anybody, do they? Table's ready. Can you make it four? For four? Oh, no, no. No, we couldn't. I insist. I want to hear all gossip about Jenny. Oh, here you are. I are. Are you sure? You are you sure? Yes, okay, fine. You go, I'll get these in. Oh, fantastic. Cover this hand in his, his hand pocket. Somebody have to take a photograph. Oh, good. Carl's Ellen, come on. I'll have half for you. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. He's all right. Yeah, 11 weeks. Yeah. That's, about, that's it. What? It's October. Oh, uh, well, to baby. You expected. So definitely. I can't wait. Col- yep. Colic, nappy rash, six hours of leave. House. Every position we got covered in snot, baby food. Can't wait. You need a b- bigger motor. But he's here he goes. Are you going to recommend a 4x4? Four four? Right. She so takes a piss. But the best car you can get by. I mean, doing runs down to lower villages. They're perfect for flooding sales. Like a Viot. Amount of water down there, you need a yacht. So what are you doing tomorrow? Oh, I don't know. Lazy day, maybe. Yeah. Sort of water surfing. Will you come over? We'll do brunch. I did get all the old photos. We give those two a laugh at their house styles. Oh, well, it's lovely, Paula. But you might just chill out and go and see Linda again. All right. Yeah. Okay. Maybe another day. Yeah. Right, yeah. I mean, I've been pushy anyway. Because we weren't even friends. I mean, you weren't even that nice to me. What? I'm sorry, you and Linda. I don't know. I think it was because we were two years younger than you, me and Jenny. And you didn't really want us around, Paula. That's not, that, that's not true. Come on. You always got, trying to get rid of us. You try to bully us quite a little bit. Bully you? Paula, don't pretend you don't remember. Look, I did, if it did, Paula, I'm sorry. Oh, it was a long time ago. No, I think it's lovely, you know. You come back for Linda a time like this. Hey, hey, you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. Well, no, I never had you down as school bully. I wasn't. I really, what, or what, I'd better watch my step. No, she's full of shit. We might, we might not want her to uh, um, Jenny around, but God, we never hurt them. What's that? It's no one. Just work. Helen, I need to speak to you. God, call me, call, speak to you. Call me as soon as you can. Oh, I'm helping D.I. Cornish. Okay, can you go in? Anything interesting? The yeah, Helen Wicks, Manchester, been skirk and did. Interesting stuff. Already gone to the lab. We've not, we just turned out what stuff. Fag end. Got very excited about the body. Who's, who found it? The body. Our man walked, walking his dog. 
the whole story. Dogman did not most of digging for it. Did not not very deep. The state was it in human body traumatized. It was his first human dead dead human. She'd been in there a while. First day open. It's all a bit insecty. These photos, yeah, it's not pretty. It's um I'm pregnant. Oh, it's a morning sickness. Maybe it's the next day. Body's burned by looks. It's pretty stinky. Well, there goes the killer's DNA. That's probably why he did it. Thanks very much. Fucking hell. Come on, piss off, sod off, sod off, sod off. Morning kind of morning. Big doggy. The walks very nice. These woods? Yeah, some ever comes here. Oh, they used to perform them. Um, yeah. Yeah, the dogs love it. Okay. Well, let's have a good walk. Thanks. Uh, don't worry. I didn't see anything. Is she all right? Honey, she's fine. I think the pregnancy took her by surprise. I wasn't like she was, we were trying. You yeah, but you're happy about it. Both happy about it. I'm definitely. Uh, Helen? Well, you know, Helen, he's, she's so driven. I think she's worried about spending too much time away from it all. Oh no, maybe she's scared about how much she's beloved. How does she come? Why does she ever never come back? Well, I mean, I know she says it's do her mum, but I don't know. She had tough ten years, Moody. Helen had big ambitions. I think this place represents everything she didn't want to in her life. Her biggest fear was that becoming someone like Linda. Either that, or she was shamed. Oh, dead, found in love again. Oh, Harley, time I was getting back. You're coming? No, I think I'm gonna go to head to town, go cover something. Something? Is that time ready? Yeah, see you, see you in a bit. Come on, babe. Oh, let us go home. Hello, hello. Gavin, do you mind? I breathe a little some real smoke. You packed it in? Yeah, sort of. That one kills you, apparently. You're the sort of, you've got to do something. I'm Paul Shelley. The Shelley. Is that what you could call me? Love it, read it. Write it a bit too. Oh, poetry writing chef. I'm a copper for you, ass. Well, if it's your boat, oh, I'll leave you to it. Yeah, it's a good idea, yeah. Hello? You? Hi, hi. What are you having? Just an orange, just an orange juice, please. What's, how's it going? Yeah. Oh, hello, it's Trevor. Is in my name over the door. Oh, so let me guess, coppers. Have I got my sign in my face or something? They say guys have radio for each other. I think radio officers do. I'm ex forces. Oh, I thought you service. Oh, well. We're just, we're just on holiday. I heard you, we drink in here, Bates. I thought we were on holiday. Your normal bloke is not Stephen. Got some funny politics. He's a bit towards the left for my liking. Not a crime, is it? So the girl was in the, his car. Doesn't prove much. Walk down like this. People give the, uh, each other lifts. My son goes to Mary's. I had both these girls in my car. So have I, many a time, lovely girl that Abigail. Not, not like some of them. I mean, she liked to drink. She had one of those stupid tattoos. Have a huge rose. It's like bloody good two shoes around here. Oh, great, Bob. Oh, well, here we go. The day into the day, right. But, uh, point the best. I've known Bob. Bob is here with the other week. Chatting about how someone had been on his farm mid of night and that was Nicks and Picklet accusing them all the blood sundry about wasn't you, Bob. Oh well, some bastard took him, gave him the first degree, seeing those spare ribs on the menu. I am still bloody watching you. And you you wonder why I can never come back. Bloody good news tonight. Pursford resident Stephen Bates has been charged in murder of teenager Abigail Toms. Abigail Burn remains discovered in Woodland yesterday. Poppy Johnson is still missing. 31 year old, 7 year old by so appeal on East Midlands Magistrates Court tomorrow. Don't think he killed those girls. Something doesn't feel right. Look, do you think you're going too close to this? I mean, I know she's an old friend, but until a few weeks ago, he was a normal family man, hardworking. No one has heard a bad word. Suddenly decides to pick up young girls and murder them. It happens. It, it, no, it happens. But I mean, it, it, it been. It could have been in mind for years, like that Dick Jane Sweeney said. Nobody's got. Everyone's got secret. You okay? Need to speak to your mate. Call his first thing. Oh, the famous, oh, the famous had a week's nice suit. I'm caught later. It's only your first bit hearing. You should see what I got f- for the trial. So, um, you guys have to congratulate me and re- name my man. Bit early for that, isn't it? So, I only got a simple, should be a question for you. Well, have you, or she has, 
We were wondering when the last time the woods was searched, where the body was found. You mean the last time the woods was searched for the body was found? Hmm. I need to check that to be absolutely sure. Search is a bit of a nightmare because of floods. All the woods it wasn't flooded. They never get flooded. I'm talking about the organization state of it. Oh, I need a check. Why are those down there? I was down there yesterday. Out having a stroll, were you? That place was this dog walker's heaven, heaven morning. No night. So why, why did it take till yesterday for them to find her? I'm not being funny. You might have put this down to chance. Okay, it happens. How uh, can she been down there for that long, though? The only thing we can be certain of is that she buried because we need baits. Other than that, we can't be certain how long she was there, can we? You guys, guys trying to ruin my party? Look, I discovered she wasn't quite a state. Yeah, burned. Not completely enough to get DNA. Obviously, Bates knew what he was doing, did he? Why did you leave her behind the fag end? Seems always the little things. Appreciate that you have vested interest, Helen. I interested, understand you know. You have a really close relationship with. Okay, no, we're not that close. But in case you've forgotten, you're supposed to be on our side. What side? I thought we'd, we're about finding the right person. And we are, have. Have you? I heard you're pregnant. Congratulations. Now, um, if you're anything like your men in my missus right now, probably you're getting over emotional. What the fuck? I apologize. Beg your pardon? I said apologize. Oh, no, it's fine. No. No, it's not. We're all coppers. We don't talk to each other like that. Apologize. Hello. I invited her to my case. I send my hand to my friendship. Tim, apologize. I'm sorry. Now, if you excuse me, about to the time of death, S-C-O- C.O. said the body was full of insects, burst open, so she wouldn't have been dead, for, could have, would have been dead for weeks. Looks like it. Looks. Look. I'm not an idiot, all right. I do understand that she was dead before she went in the bag, before the bag went in the hole. But her face don't burrow down the soil two feet. The first body, do they? No. What we did, what, so what did he do with the body after he killed her? He get, he get, he likes to turn his palm. He picked up Poppy in his car, his DNA, we have DNA match. It's not going to be a lot, it'll take a very long, is it? See ya, prick. Yeah, you said, you said it. Look, I'm not need you staying in for me like that. Well, I, all guys, bring Stephen Bates to the dock. Please give him your name, address, and date of birth. Stephen Allen Bates. 31 14 Road, Ports, Fallsford. Sorry, can you speak up, please? Stephen Allen Bates. 31 Ports, Fallsford Road. Postford, Corinne, Barbershire, 35th of November, 1978. You're charged with the offence of murder that the day between the 16th day in March and 7th day of April, 2016, you murdered Ergo Toms, who country to common law. You also charged with two counts of kidnapping, Ergo Toms and Poppy Johnson. Do you want to indicate a plea today? Not guilty. You know an invitation for bail out of concern of my client's safety. These charges are so serious, I send you the court... Case of the court, Derby Court, Crown Court. A case will be listened in two days from the day. A bail hearing within the two Crown Court. A date will be fixed for the preliminary bearing hearing. Take him down. Feel its memory. Me, Paul, has holiday in Murder Town. Oh, okay, it's fine with me. I think Helen's funny hard, though. Yeah, well, coming home. Going home does go, does strange things to people. Yeah. Listen, that info I sent you. Did you get a chance to take a look? Certainly did. And looks, dogs don't always have the most reliable reach, Paul, but they're pretty good at finding bodies. As well, whatever. None of them. Not all, not all of them. I've got lab sits there all day, barking at clouds. She eats cat shit like it's tapas. Look, Paul, they have a DNA, they have a DNA, they're witnesses. So don't, don't, that doesn't feel right though. S-C-S-C-O. So the body is barely in the ground, not very deep. But no one found it for the, it, that whole time well you know what do you think you're a killer you set the, fire the body you're out with this old swan vest and up he goes whoosh you, and then you rush back over and put on out of fire before the body completely burned look maybe I'm going nowhere with this but uh, maybe you couldn't bear to see him all burned up like that and maybe maybe it's something different perhaps he loved her but as I say I could be speaking talking out of my arse no no thanks Paul they're very 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 helpful be helpful. Just stay back. Tensions been rising on his state ever since these two girls disappeared. Now Linda Bates has returned home, having seen her husband Stephen in court. 
charged with murder by Abigail, of Abigail Tom's. Me and my side of tail need to take this. And sir, are you okay? Take a boo. Hello, sir. Helen, what are you, how are you playing at? It's nice to hear from you, sir. Too, sir. Don't miss me around. You're only on my screen on my news feed, side by side with Killer's wife. Yeah, well, I can explain, sir. Don't care. It's high profile. It's not, I just come in from, not going with me. Hello, I'm saying this is a friend. Move yourself away from it. All right. Do you think about what happened to me all those years ago? Every fucking day, Adam. You should have done better than to let Mickey tell Mickey everything. So it's mine. It's 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 Stephen Bates uh, persistently pr- refused to tell police where my daughter is. He's been asked policy for five days now. He's desperate to hear from her. Do you ever think he didn't do it? I admit it didn't exactly scream innocence. Where is this police? Hell on earth. You've been weird ever since we came down here. There's something. I, uh, I noticed something. I feel so guilty, Linda. We were 17 years old. We were little girls. I was hoping we helped. You will help me prove he didn't kill anyone. Now, I don't know what you're saying. You think Poppy's still alive? I think she might be, yeah. I think it's possible. I don't believe you. Do you don't believe her? Do you? No, I don't. No, you're enemy. Be that we learned a lot of time ago, didn't we? I know who killed Abigail Toms.